how many hours a week I play World of Warcraft depends on my schedule. Like, if if I'm really busy, then I'll play. I don't know. I'll still fit it in as much as I can. And at the highest, maybe I don't know, forty-eight hours a week. I would probably estimate I play about probably like an hour and a half a day. So, like, you know, what is that? Ten. <laughs> Well, if Adam goes home for the weekend, then I'll probably play, uh, <laughs> 40, not 40 hours, um, probably maybe 20 in a week. Usually on a week where I don't have much homework or anything, or any midterms, it's probably like four to six hours a day. I, I get, I'm a really big addict on the game, I think. I don't spend all my time, like during midterms, I didn't play very much, maybe an hour a day at the most. But uh, yeah, weekends, it's also a big consumption time too. On average, I play about maybe two hours on a weekday, but weekends I'll sometimes play a lot more. So what is that, like 10, maybe 12 to 16 hours a week, I guess? Yeah, so probably 10 hours over the weekend plus another 20, so probably 30. Uh, I've met people online and that's, I guess that's pretty cool, and we talk in our guild and everything, but I mean, I don't think my social life has really dried up in real life either because I didn't really have much of one to begin with. I mean, me and my girlfriend are still pretty good, so I guess nothing's going down or anything. It's been about the same, I don't know, uh, every once in a while I'll blow my friends off to play World of Warcraft, but a majority of my friends play, so we usually play together, so I'm not really losing any ties with anyone. You know, I, it, it's actually improved, because, you know, we always, I always have my friends come over and we live with their laptops, and we have little, little lands and we play more. Fine. Okay. It's normal. The same. Same. About... I, I don't know, it's not that bad, because it's like I know everybody that I'm playing with usually, and so it's just like chilling out with friends from back home that I never see. No, I've not, I have not made any online friends, unfortunately. Uh, you can team with people, and so when I team with people, you know, if you get to know them and you see them around the game world and you play again and you eventually kind of learn to just talk to new people. Um, I get to talk to people that I wouldn't otherwise. Like, I've met some okay people playing World of Warcraft, and there's friends from back home that I rarely see that play on there, too. And I still find time to do stuff in real life, so it hasn't really been affected. The 15-month charge right now probably wouldn't be worth it because, um our server that we play on crashes all the time and it's clear that Blizzard hasn't fixed all the bugs in it. So right now I wouldn't have I wouldn't have paid fifteen bucks, but probably in a few months or in a few weeks it's gonna get a lot better. So they then it'd be worth it now. But right now I wouldn't I wouldn't say this. Yeah, at first when I started playing I couldn't justify the fifteen dollar monthly fee, but then I thought about like a movie's six fifty or something like that. And the number of hours of entertainment I get out of World of Warcraft more than pays makes the $15 fee worth it. When you compare to like other things you would have to do, it's not that much for a month. Like, as long as you're playing it, otherwise then I guess like it wouldn't be worth it. Like me not having my own account wouldn't be worth to pay Adam, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I think it's worth the extra money. They've got, uh, Blizzard pays people to go around in-game and um, they're constantly updating and stuff like that, so it's definitely worth it because they're constantly adding new material. Well, the way I think about it is that breaks down to 50 cents a day. I mean, that's like one-third the cost people pay for their Starbucks coffee every morning or whatever. And it's entertainment. So it's worth it to me. Technically, it's only 14 bucks a month for me because I paid for two months. Um, and I mean, I guess it is. I worked my first term and lost a couple hours, or lost probably an hour a day of playing. So, I mean, I guess it kind of makes me feel better that I worked the first term, but, so I guess it's kind of worth it. I mean, I don't mind. When I end up getting tired of playing it, I'll probably 
be regretting that I paid 14 bucks a month or however much I paid. No, it doesn't really interfere with my homework at all, really. <laughs> I have I have a time to work play, then I have homework time. What are you laughing about? It's true. Um, <clears throat> no, because I don't. I can't play it on my own computer, so then I'd have to be like in here. So you're in here all the time. Not that I'm not. <laughs> okay, I am in here a lot, but I think it'll be okay. Cause it's not like I have a lot of homework for my classes. I just have to study before I have tests and go to class and stuff. I think they have from World of Warcraft just because I'll blow off class or I'll, I'll be like, well, I can rush through this project to play more, but I'll do that for other things too, like hanging out with friends or watching a movie or something. Not really. My grades have stayed pretty much the same. Um, I usually cut out social time before I cut out grade time when I'm priorita prioritizing while over, over stuff I should be doing. Last term, before I even had any before I was in beta testing, in chemistry I got a 55 on my first midterm. I mean, with World of Warcraft I just got an 80. So I mean, but I just kind of realized that when that midterm came around, I didn't play at all. I was just studying. I mean, I use it now as just if I have spare time and don't have homework, then I'll play. Or if I come back from like a crappy day class, I'll just sit back and relax and play. Or when I came back from that midterm, I played for five hours straight because I was just so fried from reading my books and notes and stuff. It kind of helps you just... We were, I was joking with a friend, it rejuvenates the mind to just sit there and do mindless video games after you've been studying. Um, I don't think my grades have really suffered. Um, I've kind of been distracted on some homework. I, I'm going to admit that on at least one homework assignment. So it was pretty big. But other than that, I think I just have to get in control of myself. And I think I've gotten better at it so far. What do I think about World of Warcraft? Um, I think it's an interesting game. I, I, I might play it if it was free, but I think that it's just like any other massively multiplayer game. And... I doubt I would pay money to play it. For myself, the biggest reason I don't play it is because I would not do anything. I would fail all my classes and I would not talk to anybody. My fiance might dump me. Um, it would just devour me and spit me out a naked man on the street in an alley. Like all my games are free. They're all way more fun than World of Warcraft. I'm not going to touch World of Warcraft because I don't want to get reamed in the ass every f damn month. Well, I, I see them less, so their interaction with real people, um, the amount of time they do that decreases. JJ never goes to class, so he pretty much doesn't talk to anybody. Well, I know Matt is up to um, almost a month on his playtime. 23 days as of yesterday. I know that Matt's girlfriend broke up with him, or for a couple days because of the game. I hardly see him anymore. I hardly see Mike either. Um, they're basically confined to the room for as long as they play the game. I mean, until they quit, I, they're never going to see sunlight. 